Hey everyone, it's Callie Own Girl Car here. It's been a long time, sorry, I've just been on uh, several of life's journeys and um, I might be talking about that later on in some new videos. But anyway, today I wanted to show you how to um, fix uh, a thin spot or a weakness in your dreadlock. And um, I was going through my hair. My hair is pretty fine, pretty soft, and um, it was hard uh, to lock in some places. And um, in some of my dreads, I have like a little weakness. I don't know if you can see it that good here, but from my end, it's like I can almost see through it. So to fix that, um, you need a, a very small uh, crochet hook. And I mean, really small. This one's 1.25 millimeters. Um, you can get these at uh, Joy and Fabrics, uh, craft stores, Hobby Lobby. Uh, you can get them online, um, a sewing store, something like that. And, um, you know, it really needs to be small. So, what you do is uh, you take your crochet needle. Here, I'm going to get close so you can see this. And by the way, um, this is also known as the Thai method of doing dreadlocks. So if you go to Thailand and get your dreads done, what they will do, they will take a little hook like this and like do this technique I'm going to show you and they make dreads that way. So anyway, you're going to take uh, your crochet hook and stick it in your dreadlock and you're going to reach down and grab some hairs from down there where it's thicker and you're going to pull them up like that. And you reach in again and pull up. And you can go up from the bottom, reach up to where it's thicker, pull it down. <laughs> and you can go in through the side, pull it in. So that was it, the movement in slow motion. It really looks like this when you get going. And it is kind of drawing my dreadlock up shorter, but that's okay because it's, you know, I want it to be thicker here, so it's okay if it's a bit shorter. So you see what you're doing is you're drawing the bottom up, the bottom thick piece, thick part up to the top thick part. And you just stick it in and catch the hairs and pull them. It could take a bit of time, you gotta be patient. Okay, I'm gonna do some upwards there. Sorry if my fingers are in the way. But yeah, you see what I'm doing, I'm drawing this together and it's getting thicker and thicker and thicker. So yeah, you keep doing that until you have the desired thickness in your weak spot and then you palm roll it and hey, it's looking better already. It should look like the rest of your dreadlock. So um, that's a technique for filling in thin spots in your dreads. <laughs> Alright, see you next time. I promise I won't wait so long to upload a new video.